Hi, everybody. I hope you're doing well. It's my day to do the children's message. I wanted to talk about the Sabbath. Does anybody know what it is, the Sabbath? Anybody have a clue what that means? Well, let me tell you a little story first. When I was a kid, you could go shopping at the store on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, but you could never go on Sunday. All the stores were closed because it was considered the Sabbath day. In my neighborhood, you, you shouldn't even go out and cut your lawn because your neighbors would be saying, what are you doing? Today's the Sabbath. On the Sabbath, you're supposed to rest. Doesn't mean you have to go to bed, but it means you're not supposed to do a lot of work. You're actually supposed to take the day and maybe go to church and think about God and Jesus and maybe read the Bible. So if you don't know what the Sabbath day is, the Sabbath day is Sunday. And in our scripture today, Jesus is walking with his disciples and he tells them that man wasn't created for the Sabbath. The Sabbath was created for man. So what do you think that means? Hmm. Sabbath wasn't created, or the man wasn't created for the Sabbath. The Sabbath was created for man. Well, I think it was that God wanted us to take a day after we work so hard all week doing all the things that we should be doing. Take a day on Sunday to rest get our bodies ready for Monday, but also to take the time to read the Bible, go to church, think about God, say some prayers, all those kinds of things. Give our body a rest. Give our minds a rest. So, during the week when you're working really hard and you're running around and you're playing and you're doing all the things you love to do, don't forget on Sunday to take a few minutes or take some time to relax, enjoy the Sabbath, Say some prayers. Do something that makes your mind and your body relax. Okay. Have a good week. See you soon. Bye.